Hey everyone, I'm Chris, and welcome back to Inside the Box, where I open up our latest products and show you what's inside. Today I'm going to be opening up the ROG Strix Z590-E Gaming Wi-Fi Motherboard. This AI-powered board is the perfect fit for your next Intel gaming PC, and I'm going to take you inside the box. The Strix Z590-E Gaming Wi-Fi is what we like to call an AI motherboard. This is because it utilizes AI to assist with overclocking, cooling, and networking to ensure the best possible system performance. Plus, our AI noise canceling technology takes care of distracting sounds and background noise. Whether you're looking to build a 10th gen Intel PC now, or are planning an 11th gen Intel build later in the year, the Strix Z590-E Gaming Wi-Fi is going to be a solid choice. Now let's open it up and see what's inside. The motherboard is the most obvious thing we expect to find in here, but let's move that out of the way for the moment. All right, first off, we've got a box here that's got a few very important goodies that we'll want to take a look at. First, this, we open it up. This is the GPU holder, which keeps even the heaviest cards standing straight inside your case. This is the 2x2 dual band Wi-Fi antenna. Now it features a magnetic base so it can attach securely to your case and can be positioned at four different angles to get the best signal. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and pull out the motherboard itself. Remove it from its anti-static bag. And underneath here, we've got some drivers, as well as a thank you card, a great set of stickers, user guide, and underneath, few more goodies. Now this is the VRM fan. In the event that you want to upgrade your cooling even further, you can go ahead and attach this. And finally, we've got an assortment of other accessories that you're going to need over the course of your build. And finally, a great ROG keychain so that you can show your allegiance wherever you're at. On the back panel, you'll find a host of connectivity options, including dual Intel 2.5 gigabit LAN connections with ASUS LAN Guard. If you can't get an Ethernet cable to your battle station, the Strix Z590-E Gaming Wi-Fi still has you covered with Wi-Fi 6E on board. The dual antenna controller supports 2.4, 5, and 6 gigahertz bands to ensure you get the fastest speeds possible in your environment. This full ATX motherboard has a mostly black design with the VRM heatsinks, Triple M.2 heatsinks, and L-shaped heat pipe, bringing sharp angles and straight lines to the design. Both the chipset heatsink and IO panel cover feature AuraSync RGB lighting that can be synced with the rest of your battle station. You can control additional lighting with the included addressable RGB headers. There are two PCIe 4.0x16 slots and a single PCIe 3.0x16 slot for your GPU and add-on cards. For power delivery, the Strix Z590-E Gaming Wi-Fi uses 14 plus 2 teamed power stages that are rated for 70 amps and features ProCool 2 power connectors, high quality alloy chokes, and durable capacitors to unleash the full potential of your CPU. You can see the Supreme FX ALC4080, which along with the Savitech SV3H712 amplifier provides crystal clear audio output. This is a very PC DIY friendly board, with headache saving features like the pre-mounted I.O. shield, clear CMOS button, and Q-code display that make installing and troubleshooting your PC a breeze. The board supports a total of four M.2 drives, including two PCIe 4.0x4 slots for ultra-fast NVMe drives. And you won't need to hunt for screws when installing a drive as our handy M.2 Q latch has you covered. The ROG Strix Z590-E Gaming Wi-Fi is currently available in stores, so check below for links on where to buy it. And if you're still not sure which motherboard is right for your next 10th, or 11th gen Intel build, then be sure to check out the ROG Maximus 13 Hero, Tough Gaming Z590 Plus Wi-Fi, and the ASUS Prime Z590-A.